in his wrath yeah. and vex them in the sword displeasure. Yeah, well, you know what that is. That's the nuclear missiles, man. That's how the Most High gonna speak to them. He's gonna speak to them in his wrath, which is those thermal nuclear missiles, all right? And and vex them in his, and, and what we got again? Then shall he speak to them in his wrath, right? And vex them in his sword displeasure. He's gonna vex them in his sword displeasure, which is that nuclear fire, man. Yeah. That's about to come upon America. From uh, Slovakia, from Russia, from North Korea, China. from China, from India, from Iran. Iran, all right, from from and from, oh, and from their allies. Yeah, they're from their allies. Yeah, that's right. No, no, it's not the other. Help you got that's right. From their allies too. Israel, Israel got nuclear missiles. They're gonna shoot them over here too, man. Uh, France, uh, Germany, uh, Britain, Saudi Arabia. Because look, Trump, Trump is talking shit against the EU and NATO, man. He's talking about how much money you are. Wait a minute, you owe us money. NATO, EU, you owe us money. Where's our money at? We want our money, man. You know, it's like when they made that, when they put them sanctions against Russia, the uh, EU and NATO was mad, man. Because Russia gives a lot of its natural gas to the EU and NATO nations, man. Yeah. So EU is like, what, yo, man, what, what, yo, what the hell is Trump doing, man? They were pissed off that Trump. Then Trump went to that summit meeting. He started pushing, he started pushing guys out the way, started yeah. popping his car, yeah, yeah. standing up all proud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. But that, that's that pride. That's that pride of Esau in America, man. Right. Yeah, he has to go to Obadiah. That's right, Obadiah the first, uh, Obadiah the one, man. One and one on down, man. So EU and NATO, they're going to shoot nuclear missiles over here. That's the most high. He's going to vex them in his sword displeasure, man. Because the most high sword displeased at this demonic, wicked place called America, man. And all the so-called white man. And two-thirds of you Negroes, like you know, the Native Americans, man. So that sword of displeasure is of that nuclear, because the sky is going to be full of nuclear missiles soon, man. That's what's soon to come to America. This statue, all them statues of, of the so-called white man, and they get their, their monuments. Because the word monument means to remember something. The white man built these monuments to remember, yeah, that's what we Get this to these so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, to the Israelites, man. That's right. That's that pride. And, 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 and Salah, here, man, make one more point. Now, we're finding out, which Apostle Wildlife brought this out, China's technology is five, six, eight, ten years more advanced than American technology, man. China got a supercomputer. America has a supercomputer, but China has a supercomputer that's five, five times more powerful than America's supercomputer, man. And America can't catch up. They're too far behind. Because China got them supersonic nuclear missiles. So is Russia. Russia got supersonic nuclear missiles. America doesn't. Yeah, yeah, so like, yeah, go ahead. They're five, they're five to ten years behind of China, man, and Russia. That's how when them nuclear missiles come over here, America's not going to be able to stop them. Why? Because the spirit of Yahweh Shai is going to be on them nuclear missiles, man. Right. That's right. That's right. Um, I was actually reading an article this morning on RT about the U.S. military and how there's a think tank here in the U.S., I believe, or in the U.K., that um, basically they, they made a report on how strong the U.S. government's military is. And although it is the best funded military, all right, most of, like, when it comes to its army, its nuclear arsenal, all right, it was on a grade from one to five, all right, most of the U.S.'s military, because, yeah, it's like on a two. And, and a lot of it was um, at one, all right, because yeah, yeah. a lot of them are untrained, People and, and like it goes back to how the Romans fell. All right, it goes back to exactly how the Romans fell. The Romans fell because they spread their military too thin. All right, and
that when you spread your military so thin, you can't even focus as much energy. All right? Yeah, yeah, and that's all the most high. Okay. All right, cunt, last scripture. Uh, you want to break it down, break it down, brother. Obadiah chapter 1 verse um, 2 says, Behold, I have made thee small among the heathen, thou art greatly despised. The pride of thine heart have deceived thee. Yeah, the most high made you small among the heathen, man. Because uh, contrary to popular belief, you so-called white people, you are not the number one nation on the planet Earth. That's right. You're not the symbol of light. The symbol of strength, the symbol of courage, the symbol of bravery. You are the symbol of the devil. Okay. You are the symbol of the anti-Messiah, anti-life. Everything that's contrary to the words that have been false. So the Most High made you small among the heathen. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's um, um, the vision of Obadiah. Thus said the Lord's power concerning Edom. We have heard a rumor from the Lord and an ambassador is sent among the heathen. Arise ye and let us rise up against her in battle. Behold, I have made thee small among the heathen. Thou art greatly despised. You are greatly despised. You are the numero uno hated nation on the planet Earth. On the planet Earth. Yeah. That's why we named one of the shows, The Whole World Hates White People. Right. And uh, what shows that? You got people ready to tear this statue down, man. Yeah, yeah. Right. They ready to do away with Columbus Day. Yeah. So that means no more days off of work, <laughs> no more school. You know, you gotta go to school, you gotta go to work. You know? <laughs> yeah, you got the police guard there. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, how they got yeah, the police guard there. Because yeah, yeah, okay, yep. you are greatly despised, Esau. Yeah. 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 I just met him with the, uh, with the heaven that a war by out the, the, the devil, even like, like, get out of here, you can really come here. That's right. Here, you come here, you, you mess it up. That's right. You know? The whole world, any movie, any nation you watch, they call him the red devil or the great Satan. <laughs> yeah, the great Satan. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And besides, if the blood of thine heart have deceived thee, thou that dwellest in the cleft of the rock. The pride of the heart have deceived thee, that thou that dwellest in the cleft of the rock. My brothers will break it down all day today. Caucasian, cave dwellers. These skyscrapers that you see are modern day caves, modern day mountains. Thy heart has deceived you because you think your generation is going to go on forever. You think America is going to go on forever. You think your, your seed is going to go on forever. But little do you know, the Most High got you ass in a trick bag, man, and you are going to fuck down. All right? You are going down as a nation. You are going down as an empire. You are going down. Yeah. And it says, whose habitation is high? These skyscrapers. Look at this monument. This yeah. habitation is on high. They got this damn monument up in the damn sky with the light beaming on it. Yeah. And it says, um, whose habitation is high, that said in his heart, who shall bring me down to the ground? Yahweh Shinnah is going to be the one that brings this piece of shit down and your whole empire down. What? Right, says, right. Go down. And with that, we're going to close it up. Death to, Death to America. 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 Death to